Step 1, from the main screen of Astro Pro, select Menu File and next select Item Select Working Folder. The selection box comes and the folder work is selected as located on the desktop. Step 2, from the main screen of Astro Pro, select Menu File and next select Item Bridge Design, next select Pre-Stressed Concrete, PSC, iGirder Bridge, and next select Limit State Method. Next, the dialog box comes to select the design standard. We select the design standard as British, BSI, standard Eurocode 2 and click on button OK. Step 3, next, the image comes, user may wait for 5 seconds or may click the mouse to close it. Next, the design workspace opens. The various main tabs are located at the top of the workspace. The tab analysis of bridge deck is currently opened. Step 4, under the tab analysis of bridge deck there are 5 more tabs, the tab user input data is opened with various default data. We click on button new design, a folder is created as design job number 01 inside the folder PSC iGirder bridge limit state BS which is created inside the working folder work. An authorized version of Astra Pro user may change the data as desired. The various input data are related to dead load or fixed load. DL. Superimposed dead load, SIDL, for loads by wearing course, parapet wall, crash barrier, and footpath or sidewalk. We open the tab General Arrangement Diagram which shows the diagrams to understand the arrangements in respect of the default input data. Step 5, next, we open the tab Section Properties, which further has three more tabs under it. First we open the tab Long Main Girder Inputs, here the user inputs are taken for various dimension details for the cross section of the long main inner and outer girders. The cross section of the girders may be different at support and at the central span of the girders. Users are notified that the red color values are taken from previous page and must not be changed here. Step 6, next, we open the tab cross girder inputs, here the user inputs are taken for various dimension details for the cross section of the intermediate and end cross girders. Users are notified that the red color values are taken from previous page and must not be changed here. Step 7, next, we open the tab Summary of Member Properties, there is no user input in this page, here all the calculated values for member section properties of longitudinal outer and inner girders and intermediate and end cross girders. Users are notified that the blue color values are all calculated values. Step 8, next, we open the tab Moving Load Data. Here various BSHA and HB class live loadings are defined on the left panel of the workspace and applications by individually or combined of these loads on the bridge deck are mentioned by following BD37-01 standard for bridge deck loading. The applications of loads depend on the carriageway width of the bridge deck with total number of traffic lanes. The value for X increment is the increment of movement of loads on the bridge deck. Step 9, next, we open the tab Analysis Process, we select tab Analysis Data and click on button Create Analysis Data, the message comes mentioning that the analysis data is created. The data files for 8 separate analysis are created inside the job folder Design Job Number 01, as mentioned before. User may select an analysis and view the analysis input data.
we select tab pre-process in the graphical user interface, GUI, opens for various visual observations of the grillage model. Step 10, next, we select tab process and we click on button process analysis, the process box comes with the list of all 8 analyses. As the process starts every time the first dialog box comes for pre-process, click on button proceed, as the pre-process is over message comes, click on OK. Next the SAP dialog box comes for the analysis process, click on button proceed, as the process is over by SAP the message comes about the output, click on OK, this completes one analysis. The same process will be repeated for all the next seven analyses. Next, the analysis report is read for all the 8 analyses, and the maximum values are extracted for the various design purpose. The analyses results will be displayed as summary of member forces and support reactions. The member forces and support reactions will be obtained for DL, SIDL, and LL. The various member forces will be used for the design of main long girders and cross girders. The total support reaction forces will be used for the design of abutment and pier. The maximum forces will be used for the design of bearings.
Step 11, we select tab post process and we select tab load deflection with magnification factor 800 and observe the deflected shapes of the bridge deck superstructure in respect of each moving live load cases. Next, we open the tab page moving load to visualize of moving live loads on the grillage model of the bridge deck girder superstructure. Step 1, we open the tab page PSC girder and the page opens with design input data. The default data for the design of main PSC girders are provided. User may change the data as desired in the authorized version of Astra Pro. The values in red color must not be changed by user, because these are taken from the input data for the analysis already as provided by the user. To process for the design user has to click on button process for new design and save as user's design with user's given file name. The design worksheet in MS Excel is always saved with a default file name and is opened on clicking the button open design report. Any design report design worksheet in MS Excel which was saved by the user with a different file name may be opened by clicking on the button open user's design by selecting user's given file name. The Excel design worksheet is password protected and cannot be opened individually from outside. Click on button process for new design and save as user's design with user's given file name. Step 2, the design worksheet opens with input page where data are taken from the previous input data page. And based on these data the results are calculated automatically in all subsequent pages in the Excel worksheet. Any other design data user may change its value directly in the worksheet and it will change the related calculated values accordingly. The various steps in the design are performed in individual pages in the worksheet. The pages are, Input, Design Data, Section Properties, Various sections along the length of the girder considered in design. Calculations for moments and shears for outer girder, forces by live load in outer girders, summary of forces in outer girder. Cable data for cable 1, cable 2, cable 3, and cable 4. Summary of Cable Forces Pre-Stress Summary Stress Check
Stress Summary Shrinkage Strain Creep strain Checks for ultimate moment and ultimate shears Effects of temperature rise and fall Design of end cross girders, shear connectors, an end anchorage with bursting reinforcement. And finally untensioned reinforcements. User may save the worksheet with a different file name, to save it for future references. Step 1, we open the tab page DexLab BS5400 and under this page there are three more tab pages, these are Analysis, Design of DexLab and Cantilever Slab Design. Step 2, open the tab page Analysis, the page opens with general design input data. The default data for the design of DexLab are provided. User may change the data as desired in the authorized version of Astra Pro. The values in blue color must not be changed by user, because these are calculated values based on data already provided by the user. Click on button Process 1 for processing the analysis. Step 3, next, open the tab page design of Dex Lab. The page opens with five more tab pages. Each page opens with various input data relevant to that part of the design. The tab pages are design loads and forces, transverse bending resistance, flexural cracking, shear calculation and figures, which contains input data and buttons to process for process 2 through process 5.
finally the tab figures may be observed for reference. Step 4, next, open the tab page cantilever slab design, the page opens with 6 more tab pages each page opens with various input data relevant to that part of the design. The tab pages are design loads and forces, transverse bending resistance, flexural cracking, shear calculation, longitudinal bending resistance and figures, which contains input data and buttons to process for process 6 through process 10. Next, the tab figures may be observed for reference. By clicking on button create design report to view the full design report. After viewing close the design report. By clicking on button view design report in text format opens the full design report in notepad, this helps the user to take a print copy of the design report. Step 1, we open the tab page RCC abutment and under this page there are two more tab pages, one with open foundation and the other with pile foundation. We open the tab page abutment design with pile foundation in limit state method, the page opens with eight tabs for various design input data. The default data for the design of RCC abutment are provided in each tab page. User may change the data as desired in the authorized version of Astra Pro. Next, to process for the design click on button process for new design and save as user's design with user's given file name. The design worksheet in MS Excel is always saved with a default file name and is opened on clicking the button open design report. Any design report design worksheet in MS Excel which was saved by the user with a different file name may be done by clicking on the button open user's design by selecting user's given file name. The Excel design worksheet is password protected and cannot be opened individually from outside. Click on button process for new design and save as user's design with user's given file name. Step 2, the design worksheet opens with input page where data are taken from the previous input data page and based on these data the results are calculated automatically in all subsequent pages in the Excel worksheet. Any other design data user may change its value directly in the worksheet and it will change the related calculated values accordingly. The various steps in the design are performed in individual pages in the worksheet, the pages are, input, checks, Seismic coefficient, DL superstructure, SIDL, DL and SIDL seismic force, DL substructure, DL substructure seismic, live load.
Live Load Seismic LL Special Vehicle, Horizontal Force Pot PTFE, Earth Pressure, Earth Pressure Seismic Fluid Pressure Summary of Forces for Foundation DL and SIDL and LL for Shaft Earth Pressure Shaft Seismic Fluid Pressure Shaft, Summary of Forces Shaft Load Combination Index See Vertical Capacity Vertical Capacity Check Combined Pile Design Second order check for shaft Counter Fort Abutment Design of Dirt Wall Design of return wall An abutment cap Puser may save the worksheet with a different file name. The design worksheet in MS Excel may be saved with a user given file name, to open in future. Step 1, we open the tab page RCC Peer and under this page there are two more tab pages, one with Open Foundation and the other with Pile Foundation. We open the tab page Peer Design with Pile Foundation in Limit State Method, the page opens with eight tabs for various design input data. The default data for the design of RCC Peer are provided in each tab page. User may change the data as desired in the authorized version of Astra Pro. Next. To process for the design click on button process for new design and save as user's design with user's given file name. The design worksheet in MS Excel is always saved with a default file name and is opened on clicking the button open design report. Any design report design worksheet in MS Excel which was saved by the user with a different file name may be done by clicking on the button open user's design by selecting user's given file name. The Excel design worksheet is password protected and cannot be opened individually from outside. Click on button process for new design and save as user's design with user's given file name. Step 2, the design worksheet opens with input page where data are taken from the previous input data page and based on these data the results are calculated automatically in all subsequent pages in the Excel worksheet. Any other design data user may change its value directly in the worksheet and it will change the related calculated values accordingly. The various steps in the design are performed in individual pages in the worksheet.
user may save the worksheet with a different file name. The design worksheet in MS Excel may be saved with a user-given file name, to open in future.